So hello guys, I am Theme Park Grease and today I'm going to be bringing you a review of Darren Brown's Ghost Train Rise of the Demon. So back in March I received a DM from Thought Park inviting me to experience the Ghost Train during a trials event that would occur on the 27th of March. The ride officially opened to the public on the 31st of March and had a few effects added after the trials. The pre-show and the first VR section of the ride is pretty much the same, however when you are evacuated there are up to three actors that come running out of the tunnel or doors that you entered through. You then proceed back onto the train where the VR has completely changed. The VR was filmed on a 360 camera inside the actual train. The green mist has finally gone. Once you get off of the train, you are tricked into thinking the ride is over. However, you enter a fake shop when everything starts to go wrong. The lights go out, the floor starts to move, shelves start to break, and the demon jumps out the wall and sprays water over you. There is also smoke effects and strobe lighting. Also, it's in a jump scare. The ghost train is much improved from last year, however, there is still work to be done. Personally, at the time of recording, I've been inside Rise of the Demon 12 times, and as you can imagine, after the first or second go, the VR becomes boring. The fake shop doesn't scare you, and you know everything that's going to happen. I hope in the future Thought Park adds some different stories that are completely different and don't simply have a different character. Recently, the ghost train has been having some major downtime, opening as late as 5.30, when the park closes at 6. What do you think about the ghost train? Do you think they'll add new stories? Or do you think they'll be forced to close it soon? I've been Theme Park Grease, you've been watching me, goodbye.